Part 2. The Man in the White Suit, 1951. The Man in the White Suit, directed by Alexander McKendrick, is a satirical comedy that reflects post-war Britain's fascination with scientific progress. The film stars Alec Guinness as Sidney Stratton, a brilliant but eccentric young scientist who invents an indestructible fabric that never gets dirty or wears out. Through this inventive narrative, McKendrick wittily explores themes such as capitalist self-interest and resistance to change. As Stratton becomes embroiled in conflicts with both big business owners fearing losses due to his invention and workers anxious about job security, he becomes seen as a disruptive force challenging established social hierarchies. The Man in the White Suit intelligently blends humor with thought-provoking insights into human nature and social commentary relevant even today. Guinness delivers an outstanding performance that anchors this delightful film while making it both entertaining and socially poignant. Hobson's Choice, 1954. David Lean's comedic drama, Hobson's Choice, is set in late 19th century Salford, Greater Manchester, a city known for its industrial working class population at that time. This charming film tells the tale of Henry Hobson, played by Charles Lawton, a tyrannical bootshop owner and his three daughters who all work for him. The eldest, Maggie, played remarkably by Brenda DeBanzi, is tired of her father's control and decides to take her fate into her own hands. Hobson's Choice is known for its witty dialogue, captivating characters, and clever exploration of Victorian social dynamics. Lean ingeniously showcases the changing societal roles through Maggie's determination to assert herself professionally without compromising on love or family. With stellar performances and a compelling story that appeals to both drama enthusiasts and fans of period movies alike, Hobson's Choice remains an enduring British cinema gem from the 1950s. More British movies in part 3.